Hi friends, and welcome back to Messy Art Monday. My name's Miss Katie, and today we are going to paint with fizzy paint. What? Fizzy paint? How do you make paint fizzy? Well, did you know that if you take regular old vinegar and regular old baking soda out of your cupboard and you mix them together, that they fizzle and they fuzz and they go all over? Right? That's so fun! So, we are going to mix food coloring in our baking soda and then add vinegar and it's going to fizzle and fuzzle and buzzle and it's going to be so much fun to paint with. So, are you ready to get started? Me too. Let's go. So if you got your kit from the library, I have pre-packaged vinegar and baking soda for you. And then of course, our food coloring that we've been using now, there's a few ways you can do it. You can put them together however you want to. It's your art, as you know. But I'm gonna show you a few different ways that you might be able to do it, okay? So first way, you can take your baking soda and you can take a regular old coffee filter, place it over your baking soda, like so. Take a rubber band, wrap it around like that, see? And then we're going to take a toothpick and we're going to poke holes in the top. So we're gonna turn, make a little shaker. So take this and I'm going to sprinkle it on my paper. Now also, since you're outside, right, you can just do this on the pavement. You don't even need paper. You can just make your own art on the pavement and I think that would be awesome. But I'm doing it inside so I'm going to do it on my paper so I don't make a mess. Alright, so there we go. We sprinkled it all over and now I'm going to take a couple drops of my food coloring and just drop it on the paper. There's some yellow. We'll do some green. Doop, doop. And then maybe a little blue. Drop, drop. And then a little red to round it out, right? Because it's always fun to use all the colors. All right, so now we can also do a few things with the vinegar. You can just splat it on your paper with your fingers and it fizzes. I know you can't see it from there, but it's fizzing. So I'm gonna do a close up of the camera so you can see how this reacts. It's so cool, but I suggest that instead of your finger, you just get a spray bottle and you pour your vinegar. I would pour it like this, but I'm a little chicken. So I'm going to put it into a measuring cup with a pour spout and I'm gonna do it that way. So here we go. Do, 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 do. In my vinegar goes. There we go. Now I'm going to take my spray bottle and I'm going to spray my paper. First, you got to get the vinegar in. Oh, there it is. Right, here we go. Does it want to work? Just keep trying. There we go. I hear it. Oh, there it goes. Okay, here we go. Whoa, it's fizzing everywhere. That is so cool. You can hear it. It's fizzing and it's beautiful. Can you see from there? Do you see what happened? Oh my goodness, that's so cool. And you can swirl it around. And then it kind of turns brown once all the colors mixed together. 
but that's fun. So that's one way to do it. And again, like I said, in a minute I'm going to show you it close up so then you'll be able to see exactly how it goes. All right. But first, I'm going to show you one more way. You just take a little ramekin or small cup and you add your baking soda in. Oof. Just take a scoop with a spoon like that. Put it in and then you will put put some green in there. I'll do one. Ooh, that was a big one. <laughs> I was just going to do a couple drops. There. It's going to be really green. All right. And now once we have our baking soda in there, if you shake it, it turns into little balls. Look at that. I didn't know that happened. That's really cool. You can make little fizzy bombs. So, let's see what happens if we put the vinegar directly in the baking soda cup. With all that baking soda, do you think it's going to make a big fizz or a little fizz? It's a lot more baking soda, so let's see what happens. Whoa, do you see? Look at that! It's fizzling and fizzling! Wow, that's so cool! Oh, it sounds so fun! Sounds like a fizzy soda. Well, and then you have your fizzy paint, and you can take your paintbrush, and you can draw with your fizzy paint. Let me, get a, let me get a different piece of paper. So here we go. So now that we made our fizzy paint, we can draw on our paper with our fizzy volcano paint. Well, isn't that super fun? That's a lot of fun. All right. But I feel like you didn't get the full experience of how awesome this really is. So what we're going to do is I'm going to move my camera and I'm going to put it so you can see all the bubbles up close. Okay? Are you ready? Let's dive in. All right. Here we are up close and personal with our baking soda. See, I put it on a plate here so I don't go all over the counter. Now I'm going to add a few drops of food coloring just so we can see. Do you see how they're balling up like that? Isn't that kind of neat? I think that's super cool. I didn't know they did that. I learned something new today. I love learning new things. I think it's so fun and important to keep learning every day. Ooh, mix those together. I wonder what color that's going to make. All right. Now that I have all my food coloring set up, I'm going to spray it with my vinegar. All right, let's see what happens. Whoa, do you see it? Do you see how it's fizzing? Can you hear it? It's fizzing! That's so fun! You can keep playing like this and you can draw with it like this. You can even use your fingers and make cool designs because that's kind of fun to play with. Or you can, like I said, just pour all the vinegar on there and just watch it erupt because it's so fun. But once the chemical reactions over, then it stops fizzing. Hmm, interesting. So much fun. Science and art, I think this is a winner of a project, don't you? All right, well you have fun with this, and I'm gonna go see if Adelaide wants to go outside and create some fizzy volcano art, because I think she'll think it's super fun, because I know I do. All right, see you in a bit.
to do this on a hole, everybody. It's going to be lots of fun, huh? Are you having fun? Looks like I already did blue. <laughs> I already did blue. Silly Billy. He'll just have lots of blue then. What color are you doing now? Green. Green. A lot of green. Do you like green? Yeah. Now I'm going to pink. Oh. Pink's your favorite? Yeah, and now I spray. What's happening when you spray it? Bubble. It's bubbling? See? Wow, that's so fun! Whoa. Pretty cool. Can we do this again? We sure can. Do you want to do it another way too where you pour in a whole bunch of vinegar and a whole bunch of baking soda and you make a big old mess? Yeah. All right, let's do that too. All right, and now Adelaide is going Hi, to... <laughs> Hello. Now Miss Adelaide is going to pour the vinegar into the volcano cups. All right, are you ready, Freddie? All right, let's see what happens. Whoa! I can need more blue. Put more, put more vinegar in there. Whoa! Look at that! Whoa! Look at that one! Oh, pretty awesome. I need more vinegar in this one. You need more vinegar in that one? Yes. More vinegar. vinegar. Sure, there's more vinegar in the spray bottle. I'll go All right. Well, we're going to keep playing with our fizzy volcano paint. And you all play with yours and see what kind of masterpieces you can make. Thanks for joining us. And we will see you next week for ice chalk and that'll be lots of fun that'll right. be even goopier than this it'll be even goopier than this one all right say see you later alligators see you later alligators in a while crocodiles see you later.